welcome back to my channel. So today is a baby girl nursery tour. I've been wanting to film this for a while. This is my favourite room of the house at the moment. If you're new to my channel, we moved into the house about nearly two months ago and we freshly decorated all the rooms upstairs. Sadie is currently six months old, but she's been in this room for about a month or two now. So I'm just going to take you around and show you. So yeah, it's a bit of a grey and pink, pink theme, so I'm going to try and show you the best that I can. So as you walk in, you have the, obviously the door and we've just got some hooks up here. Nothing on there yet apart from her sleeping bag. And this is just the mother care sleeping bag with the bunny on it. She's not using this yet because it's not actually cold enough, so I've just hung it on the back of her door. And then as you walk in, we have these three pictures on the wall here. These are from her newborn photo shoot. I love these. And I managed to find these nice silver frames in, focus. in Wilkinson's, really cheap, and they just match the pictures. Really good. So, moving on to the window area, which looks like this. We put in a radiator cover just to make it look a bit tidier and safer for a kid's room. I got this little S from. Home bargains, really cheap, like a pound or something. Reflection on these things is not very good. So I've got this pitch frame. So it's a dream big little one in rose gold. And then, you can't see it very well, at the bottom it says Sadie Jane Heslop. I got this from eBay, I think. I'll try and link it below. And then I just got the frame from Wilkinson's. I got this little night light which I don't know if it's on it goes different colors but you can make it stay on one color and it stays on for about an hour I think this was in the Aldi baby event it's a little bunny so she'll probably use that a bit when she's older it's just there for decoration at the minute so that is the radiator cover and then she has these cute little fairies which were actually mine when I was younger and I always kept hold of them in case I ever had a baby girl. Sunny broke that last one. So that's her little fairies in the windowsill. Now they're high up so that she can grab them when she's younger. When she's older, sorry. Sunny grabs them, obviously. Um, up here we have a born in 2018, which is from Next, I believe. That was a gift when she was born. And then we have these nice curtains which match the colour of the room so well and they're like the thermal blackout type curtains. These were from B&M and they are an absolute bargain. I'll try and link them below. The colour, sorry, keeps going. So that's the window area. we just got a little elephant down here which was bought for me when I got home back from hospital with Sadie. So he's just dumped in the corner at the minute. Okay, so we've gone for the pink and grey stripes on the wall. I'll try and link the paint colours below that we used. Um, and on the wall we have this picture with Sadie's hand and footprints. I think she was around four weeks old when these were done. Um, I'll link the company below that does this. It just says that on it, if you can have a quick read. So yeah, I'll link the company that does them as well. Who's our little Sadie? We're we showing everyone your bedroom, are we? She's um, trouserless at the minute because she got her dinner all over it. So this is her cot and it's from Mother Care, which was actually Sunny's old cot. And it has like a sliding drawer underneath, which is really handy. I keep all the bedding and blankets in there. I've got one of these breathable cot bumpers and um, they're called air wraps I think um, just because she keeps getting her feet and her arms and stuff legs and arms caught in between the bars Sunny did the same this is actually Sunny's old one but she rolls to this side more than that so we haven't got one on that side yet we have this cot bumper from Mother Care which is a bunny one I've folded it back because she 
she always puts her face on the side of the cot, so I've moved it back for just to be safer. It's quite cute, it's got like little butterfly and bunnies. So that's her cot bumper. I don't think they sell that anymore. Um, this is a little bunny that she got as a gift, and an elephant and bunny, which were also gifts. She's got the little sheep. Is it you and the sheep? That plays her music at night time, doesn't it? And then some more comforters here. Another bunny one. So yeah, she's got a few soft toys in there. So she has a blanket and a sleeping bag there. But she's currently just sleeping in her sleeping grow at the minute. The rest of the walls are grey. So we have the stripy wall and the rest of the walls are grey. Then she's got these pictures up here, dream big, a heart one, and a never grow up, which are canvas pictures. That one's really good because on the, the video that I introduced Sadie, that was the song I used, so that's really quite cute. Um, this is a little side table that I had to buy because it was needed in here, but it doesn't quite match the color of the cot, but it's fine, but it's fine. So on here we just have this cute lamp, which is from Fairy. Again, I'll try and link it below. That's not my fairy touchy feely book, that's just there for show at the minute. She's got a dummy and the baby monitor. This box I didn't actually buy for this cube, but it fits in okay. And this has just got like all her memories and stuff in it. So that'd be her little memory box. It's just a pink glittery one from Home Bargains and then some books that she's inherited from Sunny and obviously some of her own ones so that's her little book section then we have the little chair that I feed her on this is so comfy it's a moon chair from B&M but I believe it's supposed to be a garden chair but I use it as a little indoor nursery chair by chucking a blanket over it and some star cushions. The blanket is um, I believe from Tesco's and the cushions are from B&M and the cushions, yeah the cushions are from B&M and then to match that I've got this little star rug which matches the cushions. We have a change of mat here which again is the mother care bunny theme This is her little wardrobe, it's just a little mini one from Ikea which I actually bought second hand off Facebook and it's in really good condition. On top of it I just have this basket here and it's just got nappies and usually wipes and nappy bags. We've got a grow egg here for the temperature and some spare dummies in that pot there. And then obviously in her wardrobe she just has all her clothes. We've got a basket with socks and hats, and this basket with muslin cloths and bibs. It looks very messy at the minute. And then, yes, yeah, so that's all of her clothes in the wardrobe. Um, the only things we haven't finished on the, on the room is the doors and the door handles and the sockets. So we need to change these yet, but everything else is finished. So that's Sadie's room tour. Sorry if you could hear in the background, but I had to keep an eye on her while I was filming this. Um, I was going to do her a little reading corner, but we haven't got around to doing that. And I think I might do it when she's a bit older, when she might, because she, she's not obviously going to use it as a baby. So yeah, that's all I'll probably do in this room for a while. But I absolutely love it. I will be doing like um, Sunny's bedroom uh, room tour. He's age free, but we just need to finish a few bits off in there before we can film it. But his room's really nice as well. So, oh, I didn't show you the lampshade, hold on. This is the lampshade, and it goes with the bedside lamp. Also from Fairy, um, I'll try and link as many things below as I can, just because I know how annoying it is if you watch a video and you don't know where things are from. So thank you for watching, please a thumbs up, like and subscribe, and share with your friends if you like this video, and I'll see you all next time, bye!